All right, Sebastian, next up from the EWF PXW Joint Custody event, Rob Echoes against Rodney Axe. You know, I gotta tell you this much. I've traveled around with Rodney Axe, I've seen this kid work a lot. That kid is a high flying machine. He'll come at you 200 different ways. You never even know where he's at. I mean, he is so fast. Rob Echoes, WWE credit to his name. You can't, you can't overlook that. This should be a really good matchup. And you forgot the most important thing. What's that? Rodney X is also our light heavyweight champion. That's true. Along with the EWF. That's true. This, this should be a great match. Let's check it out. Okay, Commissioner, our first taste of championship action here tonight. The EWF's time to shine as the light heavyweight title will be on the line. Yeah! I know Rodney X, the current champion, he is awesome in there. And uh, personally, I've never seen Rob Echoes before, so this is going to be a learning experience for me. Well, Echoes, a young five-year veteran, a former hardway light heavyweight champion, so certainly long-time fans in this area know what he's all about, and this is a big-time opportunity for him to get back in the championship game. It's going to be a stiff, stiff challenge for Rodney X. So far, I am impressed. Well, all he did was climb in the ring. Yeah, but he did it well. Probably better than you or I. <laughs> Definitely me. I had to practice, but I do, I do pretty well. As we await the arrival of the EWF late heavyweight champion, one of the most dynamic, innovative athletes that has come down the pike in quite some time. Watch out for the smoke, Jerry. Champion Rodney X circling his way around the ring. You can barely hear yourself in here, Commission. Yeah, you're telling me. I just hope this microphone is picking up what I'm saying. What is that he's carrying besides a belt? I, I, I think that's his pip cup. A what? It's his pip cup, yo. Oh. I'm not at all convincing saying that, am I? No, not at all. So what does that do? Well, let's go down to Carolina Jim for the intro. The challenger, Sentence. 
And Echo is trying to bully the champ around a little bit, but Rodney X not backing down. Here we go, hard shoulder tackle by the champ. Up and over twice, leapfrog by Echoes. And an arm drag by Rodney X. Back to their feet, Echoes using his size advantage here. Backing the champ into the corner, knee to the midsection. Not a clean break, and the referee giving Echoes a warning. To the opposite corner, X stops himself, up and over. And again, connects with an arm drag, taking down the challenger. I knew this was going to be a high-paced match, but uh, I'm really surprised. These guys are moving. Rodney X carrying himself like the champion that he is, despite the attempt at intimidation by Echoes. That's a third arm drag takedown. And Echoes is really confounded here. He's frustrated and he looks a little bit flustered because Rodney X is countering everything that the challenger is throwing his way. How do you know what he's thinking? It looks like his arm's tied up and it's hurting. That too. See, between you and me, man, we can not only do this, but we could probably screw in a light bulb. Uh, Echoes trying the Irish whip again. And reversal by X, but Echo's immediately going down, and I, it looks like he, he may have popped his knee out. I think he's faking it. Oh, Echo's claiming serious injury. The referee calling for help from, from the back. I... the greatest color commentator of all time in addition to being the greatest commissioner of all time and Echoes is fine I think we saw a little bit of that funky chicken a minute ago I should have been on that one huh? make a little money on the side the side of your uh, commissionary wages to the opposite side now on 100% healthy Echoes connects with the back elbow the cover only gets a two count but Echoes in firm control thanks to that little ruse that he pulled on the champion even though that was not a good thing to do at least he got the match in his favor and that's what he wanted and it might it might result in a victory Rodney X, the sunset flip successful, but the pin attempt is not. And Echoes right back with the clothesline. I'm really surprised Rob Echoes is not on his opponent. Instead of messing with the crowd, he should be trying to win the title. Well, Echoes, always a loud mouth, always arrogant. He came in here like he owned the place, like he owned the ring. But it hasn't been that easy in the early going against Rodney X. Can he back up his claims that uh, he is the rightful champ? He's maybe well on his way. Well, if he doesn't keep his mouth quiet and get on his opponent, he's not going to win anything. But his fans certainly not keep it quiet. And there's support for Rodney X, who's firing back. So tough, so resilient. The light heavyweight champion will not stay down, but looks like Echoes won't stop having him until he does. Let's talk about that ref for a second. What do you think about him? I think he's doing a mighty fine job thus far. I think you're wrong, but you're entitled to that opinion. Certainly a, uh, an emotional... High pressure situation in front of this capacity crowd, not only for the athletes, but the referees as well. It's a spotlight that uh, it takes a champion of sorts in, in their own right to uh, perform in front of. What? I wasn't listening. I'm sorry. What are you doing with that cup? I wonder if I rub it three times, if, if I can be a pill. You're talking about the cup, right? What cup? 
Rodney X back to his feet. Reversal of the whip, ducking under the clothesline. The quickness of the champion. Satellite head scissors. Vertical press. Ah, uh, two. Listen, I see you have that pimp cup in your hand. What are you doing with that? You can't have it. No matter how much you want it, you're not going to be a pimp. I could be the first Jewish pimp. Into the opposite corner. Echoes taking too long. Meets nothing but turnbuckle springboard and scissors. And beautiful takedown by Rodney X. Two. Oh, and Echoes into the ropes. The challenger has rolled to the outside. Maybe a move of desperation. Ronnie the X going right after him, up and over. Both champion and challenger giving it absolutely everything they have because that's just how much a victory here means to both men. Well, of course, there's a title on the line. What do you expect? They're going to give it their all. And just managing to break the count. Echoes rolled in the ring. Rodney X to the top. Oh! And he flew right into that super kick by Echoes. Certainly a move he likes to utilize. Could be a knockout. And no! Rodney X again showing that toughness. I thought I saw a tooth fly out of there. Did you miss that one or am I just making stuff up? I think it may have flown right into the pit. That's disgusting. Echoes dropping the champion crotch first onto the top turnbuckle. You heard the reaction from the other guy in the audience. And X shoves him down. X is perched. Rodney X is going to fly. Beautiful flying Huracan Rana. Two. That's it. Wow, he got him. the heart, it was the determination, and it was that willingness to put his body on the line that brought Rodney X to the light heavyweight championship, and it was all those things that brought him to a victory here at, jo at joint custody. All right, Sebastian, how about that? That was Rodney an amazing X. match. Amazing. Rodney, Rodney X. Def de defended his title. Spectacular match. The ending to that thing was just amazing. I, I cannot believe what Rodney X can do in that. High ring. flying, submissions, all kinds of stuff thrown in there. Excellent match. Great. If you like this video, please go ahead and subscribe, slam that like button, and share it. If you didn't like it, let us know by slamming that dislike button twice. Thanks for watching. See you soon.